Chrisfield has a rich sports history from CSUB basketball's recent success to BC football's national championships or even Hall of Famers getting their start with the Blaze. There's certainly a lot to choose from, but arguably one of the city's greatest nights came on a warm June night 50 years ago today. The year was 1967. Bakersfield College's Memorial Stadium was the site. Gil Bishop, the Renegades athletic director at the time, brought a number of AAU track championships, and with it, the nickname Track Town USA. A year before the Olympics, these were some of the fastest runners in the world. Marty LaCorey finished seventh, and he broke the four minute mile. That is Jim Ryan, quite surprisingly, going to the front. A 20 year old sophomore from Kansas, Jim Ryan had set the world record in the mile the year before. Ryan would later serve as a congressman. His colleague, Bakersfield's own Bill Thomas, was in the crowd that night. Whenever you try to go for a record, they tend to make sure you have the best chance, so they get a so-called rabbit to run out front, drop off after, say, half a mile. There was no rabbit in the race. The rabbit was Ryan. Boy, he just jumped off that start and looked like a man determined to do something here tonight. In front of 12,000 fans, Ryan quickly paced the field, all this on a cinder track. Very similar to a dirt track, but a little bit more packed. The dust kicks up, and it's kind Kind of if you went to local high school, be more similar to that than it is to this. Keep an eye on that clock all the way now is Jim Ryan all by himself. On a sweltering Bakersfield night, Ryan won by 40 yards with a time of 351-1, a new world record. When he finished the race in world record time, Gil Bishop asked him if he would run a victory lap. And he said, yeah. And he said later, he felt good. He probably could have run faster. That was the fastest Ryan would ever run the mile, and a record that would stand for almost a decade. That was the ultimate when that occurred. 50 years later, he's the last American to ever hold the world record for the mile. How many track meets was he in all over the world, including the Olympics? But he said that one was special. At some point, BC hopes to have him back to celebrate his history. That hasn't happened yet, but I just think that would be so exciting to have him mm -hmm. back in this stadium. A world-class moment forever tied to Bakersfield. For 1967 in the small town of Bakersfield. <laughs> uh, it was phenomenal. Now, we couldn't get a hold of Ryan for this story, but in previous articles, he's quoted as saying the track that night was like running on sawdust, making it hard to turn on the turns. He thinks he could have run even faster. Today, he directs a running camp with students across the U.S. In the studio, Stephen Hicks, 23 ABC Sports.